taking a look today at uh, filter element from uh, Triumph TR3. It's a cartridge type filter. This happens to be a Baldwin P174. Uh, my local guy doesn't carry Baldwin anymore so I guess I'll have to look for these on the internet. But uh, this particular engine has got a lot of gasoline mixed with the oil. I'm not sure why. And uh, so the oil is very thin and I think it's scouring a lot of grit out of the engine. There was a lot of grit in the canister uh, that surrounds this. So let's cut it open here. Eh, kind of interesting. It looks like it's stitched like a sewing machine. I'll make a cut right along here. And then go around it. Mostly want to see if the amount of grit inside is similar to what I saw in the canister. Kind of thought that end cap would come off as one piece, but it didn't. I don't really understand the construction here, but it appears to be a cardboard end cap, completely uh, non-metal. Now the non-Baldwin uh, replacement that I got did have metal end caps, but the Baldwin is paper on the outside. Pretty uh, tight arrangement of the folds there too. So we'll keep going, cut this end off. Again, it's a cardboard uh, cap on the end. Metal tube up the middle. This cardboard sleeve around the outside. Perforated metal tube in the middle. Well, this seems like it wants to stay in a circle, and maybe I'll just run with that. So... A fair amount of grit built up in the uh, in the folds. Maybe not as much as I expected, based on how much was in the uh, in the canister. There was like a tablespoon full of grit in the canister. I can't exactly tell which end of this was up. If I had to guess, I would say this side was down because there seems to be more grit. Well, I'll go back and say I can't tell which end of this was up. The grit seems to be pretty evenly deposited across the uh, across the folds. And boy, I'm seeing this bright metal with the uh, oil pressure problems that I'm having with this engine. I, wouldn't be surprised if that's bearing metal. So that uh, about all I can say. I don't have any record as to how long this was in service. I guess that's it. Thanks and be sure and watch my other videos.